Greetings and salutations, YouTube Wanderer. The Lost One Gaming here, and welcome back to the council. So, I guess I'm supposed to be finding my room now. Uh, who is this for? That's Emily's. That's not my room. Uh, I guess we're gonna run around the corner real quick and see. Um, this one... That is somebody else's. Manuel Godoy. That's not my room either. How long am I gonna have to search for this? And are all the rooms on the right, or are there rooms to the left too? Uh... There's no one to help me. Where are all the servant people that were supposed to do this? Here we go. That's my room. Huh. That's me. <clears throat> That's me. That's all he has to say about the room. Yeah, okay. You know, what is that picture up there? Right. So what shall I do with this letter? It might be about my mother's disappearance. You know, but I'm actually it, not going to open it. I'll be it. betraying Piaggi's trust. What should I do? I'm not actually going to open it. You know, open the letter without breaking the seal. Yeah, I don't have that ability yet. I'm just gonna leave Damn. it closed. Can't wait to open it, but I gave my word to Piaggi, so... What are these pictures? Too bad. I'll wait until I hand it to Mother. Wow. Nice room. Mortimer sure doesn't do things halfway. Yeah, he's like freaking putting up pictures of goddamn Kronos eating children. At least I think that's what that picture is. I, what? These pictures are terrifying. Imagine sleeping in this room in the middle of the freaking night and seeing this crap. Like, what? What is that? I don't even want to know. I don't want to know. Uh, Carmelite water gives you the focus state. Your next skill will not cost any effort. You cannot carry more than five. Press four to use it. Okay. So that's a new thing. I also did uh, restore my effort points too. I found out how to use that. Uh, Saint Jerome and the Angel. Yet again, art with political undertones with an image of a saint hearing voices. Oh, great. Do I have to look at all of these? Saturn devouring his son. Oh, there you go. I saw the same theme in the hall. I wouldn't like to be his son. No, you definitely wouldn't want to be his son. Saint Francis of Assisi in ecstasy. Before superior voices. Before superior voices. It always voices. amuses me to see how art gets used for propaganda purposes. Okay. There's a lot of stuff in here apparently I have to look at. And I can't unlock that, so I guess I'm just going to have to leave it. Uh, what's this over here? I thought there's stuck okay, in Inferno there by Dante. Dante's Abandoned Inferno. Hope, all ye who enter here. Lovely lectures Mortimer is giving to his guests. Very jolly. <laughs> Once you come into this room, you're never going to return as the person that you came in here <laughs> being. Is this all in the room now? I think that's pretty much it. I don't think there's anything else that I can look at. So I'm going to head back uh, over to that door then. And uh, there's a door here. I guess I'll go outside. Anything out here? At all? Oh, uh, it's like a... It's an alleyway. Oh, uh, it just tells me to go to bed. So should I just go back inside and try and go to bed? <laughs> what is... Oh. Is this a... Oh, that's the bed. Okay, there you go. Great. I'm going to bed now. <laughs> Taking like half of my clothes off. <laughs> Does it actually need to show me going to bed with these creepy pictures up above me? Like, really? This is what we're doing right now? I wonder what journey awaits us in the morning. Uh, off the coast, I did not find any clues about Mother on the docks. Success went up to the manor. Didn't pick up the book on the quay. Alternate paths. Could have joined... Uh, could have joined Star Home in the small salon. I could have made an unexpected encounter. Uh, so... I failed two things. Was that the end of the level? That was the end of the episode. <laughs> Really? Uh, so we made it to level 2. Objectives completed, 1,400. Traits unlocked, 120. 200 character traits revealed. Uh, 120 for new characters met. Vulnerabilities exploited, 100. Items found, 0. So I wonder what I was actually supposed to find. Like, in terms of, like, things out there, like clues. Maybe if I had opened the letter, I would have found something. Um, so we now have 4 points that we can use. I think, uh, let's see. Should I put a point into subterfuge? Discreetly steal items, pick locks, notice falsification, uh, occultism. Uh, I think we're going to put a point into subterfuge. Maybe we'll put three points in there. I don't know, because I kind of wanted to see like if I could do like opening things without people knowing. Etiquette conviction. Convince people with sheer force of your will and your attitude. Uh, politics. Mm, linguistics. I don't really know how much, like, all this stuff is going to help me necessarily. 
like questioning. Sure, let's do that. Uh, agility, I don't really know how fast I'm going to need to run at all. So none of that really helps either, does it? I guess I'll put another point in the subterfuge, like three points there. And uh, I guess that's what we're going to do. All right, that's validated. Equipping manuscripts. Oh, uh, equipping manuscripts. Here you can choose what to read during the adventure. Each manuscript you read confers skill points at the end of the quest. Okay. So all we have is the Laws of Galantry by Charles Sorrell from 1644, a play that might first appear trivial, but is in reality an informed analysis of the codes of polite society. Okay, so I have to start quest. Maybe this isn't the end of the episode. Okay, no, there's more. Alright, because I was like, that can't be the end. Like, that that was just so freaking <laughs> anticlimactic. What is going on? What? Who, why the frick are you in here? What are the two of you doing in here? Why are you in my room? Why am I now, like, awake? <laughs> I was in bed, like, two seconds ago. Now I'm standing up watching them play freaking chess. And... Your turn. Wait, what? The servants are not very efficient. No, they Boucher aren't actually. Can't be far away. They'll find her soon. Their search time is restricted, given that they must keep an eye on Adams. Adams. I can take care of her. You know? Yeah, with your yes. freaking creepy face. Well, in any case, I do Why thank they close you up for so bringing her his mouth? to the island. From what I've understood, the search of De Richet's room hasn't turned up any results. Not yet. You're not no. looking hard enough. But we've put her son in there. Perhaps he'll find something. Why do they expect me to do this? That might come in handy. Louis grows impatient at not yet having met the famous Lord Mortimer. He I thought his head disappeared tomorrow. for a second, but he's bent down. Oh, what a pity to lose a knight at the start. Do they not? The game. Am I actually not in here? Like, what is going on right now? Are you waiting for someone? A young French soldier. During young our French game of chess. Soldier. Don't worry, Gregory. The game won't disappear. You sure about that? Oh, is this Napoleon? It's Napoleon! I know my way out. Ah, good evening, gentlemen. Please forgive me for this late hour. It is never too late. And we have much to discuss. You should be wearing a hat. One last move? Ew. <laughs> He's not very not very happy about this. He throw the chess piece in the fire? Well, he's Don't mad. Worry. Our games always seem to end like this. Or always start like this. Why am I just walking out now? What Come, am I? Take a seat, my friend. What was my purpose of standing there? It's almost as if I no one knew what I was doing anyway. Character reveal Napoleon Bonaparte. Okay. I'm like still half dressed with no freaking shoes on. That's nasty. Walking around here like that with no shoes on. There's George. Why is everybody awake now? <laughs> Wait, I'm a little nighttime what? stroll, Mr. President. There's nothing like it for a good night's sleep. I keep going from freaking myself to, to this guy. To show you back. The corridors seem quite safe. Are you gonna kill George? <laughs> Peppermint, lime flower, and valerian. My miracle remedy when one can't get to sleep. Lucky you can a very good some night sleep. To you, Mr. President. Thank you. And to you too, sir. This is getting really creepy. I don't like it. Wait, is George trying to... What? Uh, what? <laughs> this game is really... I, now my nose is bleeding. Here we go with this again. The flash forwards and flashbacks and crap. Ew. I'm coming! Who's at the door? Is it George? I'm assuming because he was supposed to be the one. Uh, how did I, I just randomly put on my clothes again? I'm assuming because he he was the one that I saw in the picture that was coming towards. Not not the picture, the flashback that was coming towards. Listen, George, I'm coming. God dang it! Wait a minute. Give me a second. Which door is it? Was it, or could I have just open the other door? Do I need to open this door? I guess I do. Excuse me. Am I bothering you? Well, you just kind of barged in, but no, I no, guess not. not in the least. Is something wrong? I'm going to need your help. With what? Do you remember the young lady we spoke of in the hall? Uh, Adams? Elizabeth Adams. Yeah, that Home introduced lady. her to us. <laughs> yes. Well, she is the daughter I of thought friend, so. the I called President it. John Adams. But she is supposed to be dead. Yeah, 
That's really? bizarre. Fair enough. Good heavens. I was present at her funeral. And she's it somehow is disturbing alive. indeed. Yes. I need to make sure it's her. He still got a spit coming in. out of his mouth. I want you to distract Elizabeth while I search her room. How am I supposed to do and that? Perhaps get my hands on some important information. At least I hope so. Elizabeth hmm. is in the small salon. If you hurry, you can still catch her. I just small need salon. ten minutes. But if my vision is true, there are two men nearby discussing very important issues, and one of them looks much like Mortimer. Washington is very kind, but I came to this island for my mother, not for his ghost. I'm gonna help George. Cause I feel like that'd be a little bit more interesting. Although, <sighs> investigate about the. Vi I'm gonna help George. Count on me, sir. Cause I want to know about friend. this this Adams lady too. Keep Elizabeth downstairs as long as possible. She must not return to her room. Trust okay. me. Put the moves on her, maybe. <laughs> no, not really. All right. So I'm gonna have to achievement unlock son of Lafayette. John Adams, According join Adams in the small Lady salon. Adams is in the small salon. I better hurry. How the frick do I get downstairs? <laughs> do I go back this way? I'm assuming I run back down the hall and then... Was there a flight of stairs somewhere? I'm running as fast as I possibly can at this point, so... I'm thinking... Okay, yeah, here's the stairs. What is this? Did I just click it? There we go. I was actually gonna run completely down the stairs and the game's like, nah! Oh, is that the, the cardinal? Cardinal's here. He's being creepy too, like he's listening in on somebody as well. So, uh, where the frick is this Adams lady? Uh, hold on. Is there, is there a map I can use? Four Court Manor, Great Hall of Zeus. Uh, apparently I don't know where the frick this place is. So, and I don't see her anywhere. Is there something over here? Is there a door that I can open? No, I can't open that door. I guess I'm just gonna have to go towards the Cardinal and see what he's up to, because, uh, there seems to be no other real rooms in here. There's- and there's no one over there, you know, by the statue, so... I'm gonna go talk to the Cardinal. Why are you still listening out here like that? Ah, my son. Oh, you are a godsend. What's Am the I? matter, Your Eminence? I believe a Miss Adams may be in danger. Really? What do you mean? Do you hear that? She is being manhandled in this small salon. They can't manhandle her. I don't know exactly. Uh, a thug, a Frenchman, it seems. By the cut of his cloth, I'd say he's a member of the French Revolution. Oh, this is Napoleon again. Should do something, my son. Am I gonna have to fight Napoleon? <laughs> I'm going in. Shit! I was supposed to make sure Adams wouldn't go back to her room. She can't go back. She's dead. Don't worry, Your Eminence. I'll take care of it. Probably nothing to worry about. Do you want me to call for help? Please don't do anything. I'm. Sure, with a little goodwill, everything will work out fine. Or I'll get my butt kicked. Don't go and wake up the whole manor, please. Oh, thank you, my son. May God watch over you. I am going to die based on my decisions that I've just made. <laughs> I'm going to immediately regret this. Who do you think you are? Forget multiple paths. There are multiple paths to reach your objective. It may be a good idea to think twice before embarking on the first path you come to. Okay. Hey, sir. If we were in France, I'd have sent you to the guillotine. So that's not Napoleon. Sir. Please, just let me go back to my room. Guy, this guy has a weird eye. Hey, you! Stay out of it. This is none of your business. Maybe it is my I'm business. Teach this little slut how to oh wait, what you didn't have to do on? that. Huh? I don't think you know who I am. I don't know who you I are. You. I I didn't mean to. Don't hit me, please, sir. Shit. Uh, if I step in. <laughs> Adam might just run back uh -uh. here. Uh uh. Nothing. Yes, Washington will have enough time to search, but this girl's gonna uh -uh. suffer. What is his what are his grunts in the background? Oh, these just no, you could not do that. Stay out of it, boy. Trait unlocked gentleman. Shit. God damn it. What did he just drop? I told you to mind your own business, boy. Oh, confrontation start. Uh-oh. Oh. I'm out of my mind, am I? Because I don't know who the frick you are. I'm not gonna be able to intimidate him. You're not back in your slum now. You're in Lord Mortimer's home. Exactly. I suggest you think carefully about what you're going to do. Don't think you're getting away with it that easily. Oh, I will. I'm Trust me. I'm sick of all these toffs. If we were in Paris, I'd send you all to the guillotine. Well, we ain't in Paris, and I ain't going to the guillotine. A woman telling me how I ought to behave? I won't stand well, for Well, I ain't it. a woman, so oh, I'll okay. tell you. Okay, wait a minute. What? Don't tell me you're going to defend these harlots. Dang you. There's nothing. Let's calm things down. That takes two points. 
Hold on. Let's take a second and... Exhausted. You've encountered an immunity. Oh, so he doesn't freaking care. Think about this. We're not animals, so let's not act like one. I knew you were a panty waste. Oh, really? You, you want me to punch you in the face? Puke. Okay. You really are an animal. I get the feeling you're trying to put one over on me. Oh, if that's boy. the case, you're making a big mistake. The frick is wrong Sorry with your eye. That. Look, there's no point in us aggravating each other. Let's both just go our separate ways. Don't move. We're not done yet. Why aren't we, we done to be yet? the knight in shining armor and save the damsel in distress. All right. Let's see how brave you are. Oh, frick. Someone threw you off balance. The cost of effort point increases when you're using your skills. Use a golden elixir to cure yourself. How did I use that again? All right, remain dignified. Aim true. You only get one shot. Oh this, wait, this, that's this, not really what I want to say. Couldn't miss. If you miss, you're a dead man, sir. Uh oh. I'm being ballsy. This isn't really what I intended to do. Uh oh. Okay, it worked. I'm not in the habit of beating Lord Mortimer's guest in his own salon. But you just said that wasn't gonna work earlier. Got off easy this time, but don't try it again. What the frick is going on? He just said, like, you're not going to use that ploy on me. I don't care where I am. If we were in France, blah, 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 blah. But now all of a sudden he's just like, ah, oh, you know what? We're in Lord Mortimer's house. You're, you're right. I'm not, I'm not, <laughs> I'm not going to, I'm not going to kill you because we're in Lord Mortimer's house. Where the frick did she go, though? Like, she just ran off. And what is all this stuff? I'm, I'm trying to look for clues and stuff. I'm going to remember the object. The brooch Elizabeth was wearing. Huh. She was so frightened, she was unaware that she'd lost it. Yeah, well, it didn't seem to do her much good. I was going to say, shouldn't I just pick it up? That would have made more sense. All right, I'm going to look for some more things around here, and I'm probably going to call it an episode. But, jeez, what the frick was that whole confrontation, man? <laughs> what was it? And who is that guy? Like, I didn't really get an explanation. Wait, did it tell me who he was? Like, a character wise let's see talent traits how can i get to journal hold on mortimer adams hillsborough no that's that's piat no that's not him servants peru jacques is one of the fathers of the Tr revolutionary tribunal of paris during the terror he quickly became one of the most worrying figures in all of paris distinguished himself by taking part in the siege of bastille and the capture of louis the 16th the current king of France. He was involved in the creation of the Revolutionary Tribunal. Is he a man of law or torturer? Nobody dares say. This judge of the people has overseen many trials that sent uh, opponents and traitors of the revolution to the guillotine. Peru interrupts his revolutionary activities when Lord Mortimer, his patron, invites him to join the social gatherings. So he has an immunity to diversion, so that's his thing. Alright. Well, let's hey, see this book. These look like pages taken from an ancient encyclopedia. How am I supposed to know? Okay, whatever. There's another box here that I think I may be able to open now. Five circles on this chest. Uh, I can. I can open it, but what? Am I actually gonna have to do this myself, or what is this? These ashes? Oh, golden elixirs. Golden elixirs cure all your negative alterations. You cannot carry more than five. Press two to use it. Okay. I do need to use that because I already have like two of them. So. There you go. Use that. And now we're cured. There's still more in here, by the way. You didn't take all of them. Just saying. But alright. What's on the floor? Collector coins. Alright. Don't know what that's gonna be good for at all. Let's see. That's more That's more royal jelly. I needed some more of that, actually. Because I'm kind of out of points now at this point. Because of that whole altercation thing. <laughs> thing. Alright, I'm leaving the salon. I don't think there's anything else for me to look at. I guess we're gonna uh, see what's going on with Mrs. Adams. Maybe she's gonna thank me for what I did. Or George is here now. Well, did you get time to search the room? No, Louis, she came back. I only needed ten minutes. So I Imagine messed up. Imagine the scandal if she had found me. What would you have done in my shoes? She was in the middle of an argument. So I shouldn't have done that. Guy. Ten minutes. I didn't ask for the moon. Nonetheless, so you I messed found up. what you God were looking it. for, didn't you? Not everything, but yes. Elizabeth is definitely the daughter of John Adams. Okay. We need more information. You can like always what? go back. It's too late now. God dang it. I feel like I'm a failure at this game. And it's like... Uh, I, like I, I figured that maybe, like he said, if I had just left it alone, 
that she would have like it would have been enough time for George to do what he needed to do. But at the same time, it's like, what would have happened if I, like, if I didn't? Like, would he have killed her? Would he have, like, freaking beat the crap out of her? And then I would have just been like, oh, well, you know what? <laughs> she's not making it back to room because she's freaking dead. Like, you have, I mean, this game, you know, it really kind of puts choices into perspective. So it's like, you kind of have to think about each and every choice that you make. And it's like, okay, what happens if I do this? What happens if I do that? How does this play out towards the end or what I whatever I'm trying to do? I feel like I did the right thing in terms of stopping her from, like, getting abused, <laughs> but, you know, George Washington was a little bit upset, you know, and, uh, Devil's Thorn grants you an exalted state. You temporarily see the immunities and vulnerabilities affecting a dialogue choice and a conversation. Ooh. That would have came in handy earlier. I guess it's good to explore so you can find stuff like that. Um, but I'm gonna end it here, guys, and I will see you in the next one.